Hey guys, it's Steve and welcome to a new Blender quick tip. Today I'll be changing the look of Blender. So I'm going to be using a different theme and showing you guys how to install a different theme in Blender 2.71 and this works all the way back to Blender 2.64. So starting with Blender 2.64 they implemented an easy feature for changing your themes and uh, before I mean it was always just like a script you could run so it's pretty simple all along and uh, if you're new to Blender or haven't heard of it you might be interested in knowing how to do this. So like myself I've been using Blender for two or four or five years not two four or five years and I like the theme but other people coming from different softwares maybe Maya user or 3ds Max user might prefer a theme that matches uh, their old kind of software or something like that. So I'm going to show you how to change the look. To start, I'm going to jump over to Blender Nation to show you guys the theme I'll be using. And it's going to be version 14 Energy. Now this uh, Energy 14 theme has a few cool things uh, that they've done. And a lot of people like this look. It's probably the most commonly used Blender theme, I'd say. And there's just a few things that seem nice about it. The viewport is brighter than Blender's default, avoiding retina burn on long hours of use, and a few things like that. But um, mostly I'd say it comes down to uh, your preferred, you know, personal preference, what, what you prefer to see. So I'm going to show you how to install this now. Basically, you're going to go to this link here, and I'm going to have it in the description so you don't have to go looking for it. You're just going to right click this and click save link as, then save it wherever to your desktop, doesn't matter. I already have it on my desktop, so I'm just going to leave it. Then you're going to switch back to Blender. You're going to go file, user preferences, and then you'll probably be like here, but you just click themes and you'll have these settings here. Now you can install your theme here, you can reset to default here. And if you're feeling adventurous, you can make up your own theme here with all these different colors. And basically, all these different colors change different looks wherever. I don't see that one changing anything, but you can see, like, this one's changing the buttons down there. And yeah, if you feel adventurous, go ahead and make your own Blender theme. I'd recommend trying one that was already made pretty professionally and uh, looks great. So I'm going to show you how to install Energy 14. So you click Install Theme, select Energy 14, and bam, you install it. It's that easy in Blender now, uh, starting at Blender 2.64. So now let me get this out of here. You can see I am using the Energy 14 theme. It's pretty cool looking. They have basically all your options or all your uh, settings are in white, and then all your options under that setting is in yellow. and you know, it would take a little getting used to for me, but I might prefer it. I'm gonna have to uh, kind of have to play around with it a little bit and see what I think, because I'm used to the uh, original, like some of you guys might be. But um, there you go. That's how you change the theme. And if you don't like it, you can always just go user preferences and restore to default theme, and you're back running like normal. So that is how to do it. Very simple, very easy, and uh, just a quick tip there. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, leave some love on the video, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.